Hello, hello, hello. I hope you've all been doing fantastic. Welcome back to my channel and thank you for joining me for another watercolor painting today. I hope you've all been enjoying the Stranger Things paintings I've been putting out and if you haven't seen the new season then you should get on that because it's pretty good. I have one or two more of those types of paintings yet to come in the future, but for now I'm going to take a little break from that and but we're still sticking to the 80s themed paintings. We'll be doing a portrait today of none other than the Duck Man, otherwise known as Ducky. Um, if you grew up watching 80s movies and were particularly fond of Molly Ringwald movies, then you'll know exactly what movie he is from. I don't know about you, but Ducky was always my favorite. Way, way better than Blaine. I mean, the dude didn't even blink. Like, he probably blinked like five times in the entire movie. If you really think about it, Ducky was always there for her. Ducky sang to her all the time. Blaine lied about taking her to prom, and then who did she end up going with? Ducky. <laughs> and then Blaine stared at her with that heart-winning dead-eyed stare from across the room and she was in his arms once again. Ducky never had a chance. Poor Ducky. If any of you guys have ever seen this movie, if you grew up watching it or if you just have recently watched it, um, let me know what you guys think. Do you think she should have ended up with Blaine or Ducky? Let me know in the comments. So, I have very young parents. Growing up, me and my sisters watched a lot of 80s movies, from Pretty in Pink to The Goonies to Killer Clowns from Outer Space. We watched, like, all of them, um, which is why I really, really love this era. It just reminds me of the good old days, even though I'm only in my early 20s. When I was 18, I went through a 80s phase where I'd mainly watch slash listen to 80s music and watch 80s movies. I even got into rolling my jeans and backcombing my hair. Have any of you guys ever gone through a phase where you're like obsessed with a certain time era? And if yours was also the 80s, what were your favorite 80s movies? So close to the end here, my camera died and some of the detailing was lost. But anyways, I went in and did my fine lining with an ink pen added some small dots all over the blue background and added the words above him that read pretty in pink. So I hope you enjoyed this video and also please comment below any painting ideas that you would like to see and thank you for watching. I hope you guys really enjoyed. I'll see you next time. Bye.